Hi there folks, Kevin Carroll here, taking a look ahead to what we're working on for Sunday's edition of the Times Leader. And I can tell you, we really have a lot going on today. Jennifer Lernandes has a look at what voters need to know ahead of Tuesday's primary election. And if you didn't hear, former President Donald Trump has weighed in on the Pennsylvania gubernatorial race. I was out at the Luzerne County Courthouse earlier today as women's rights advocates rallied there and over on Public Square in response to the expected U.S. Supreme Court ruling on abortion. I was also over at the 44th Cemetery where Wyoming Valley Ghost Tours held a craft fair. That's right, they held a craft fair inside the cemetery. You're going to want to read on that. In sports, executive editor Joe Soprano will have a feature about Timothy O'Donnell of Shavertown, a heart attack survivor who will be competing at a triathlon in Tennessee. And features writer Mary Therese Beeble will have a look ahead to the upcoming Fine Arts Fiesta. And remember too folks, Blackout Bingo is underway. You can find your in the paper each and every day. As always, folks, we thank you for reading, and if you're not already a Times Leader subscriber, all you have to do is call 829-5000 or go to timesleader.com backslash subscribe. Well, that's all for now, folks. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.